Hi everyone, welcome to Help Your Math. Today we are going to use two different u substitution to solve the following four problems. The first u substitution is a regular way to solve it. Second u substitution is the u substitution shortcut. Let's look at number one. Number one we have 3x plus 2 to the 14th power dx. We are trying to solve this by looking as u to the nth power to u. So we have to use our base as our u. u equals to 3x plus 2. By the regular u substitution method, we take derivative on both sides to get a du equals to derivative of 3x is 3 dx derivative of 2 is 0. Now after we finish take derivative on both sides we are going to substitute u back to the function so all the x will become u and dx must be a du. Now we substitute first 3x plus 2 is our u so that's going to be u to the 14 we must get our dx by itself, so we're going to use our second function here. 3dx divided by 3, that's going to be dx equals to du over 3. So our dx will be du over 3. We're going to put 1 third in front. Now we have u to the 14th power du which is equals to one third u to the 14 plus 115 over 15 plus c. This is not your final answer since our function is starting with x. Now we're going to substitute x back to the u. That's going to be 3x plus 2 to the 15 over 15 plus c. Second u substitution shortcut. We first define our u the same as a base, u equals to 3x plus 2. u prime, derivative of u equals to 3. That means we must have a 3 in front. However, we don't have it, so now we're going to create a 3 in front. Creating a 3 is by using 1 third times a 3 which is 1. So we didn't change the function. So now we have 3 times 3x plus 2 to the 14th power dx. Now we have a u prime right here. We have u to the nth power. This is going to be equals to 1 third 3x plus 2 to the 15. That's 14 plus 1 over 15 plus a c. Oh, sorry, Let's see, that's it. That's problem number one. Problem number two. 4t to the third. Multiply t to the fourth plus 4 to the eight dt. So using the u substitution, we use the base right here. To set up u as t to the fourth plus a four. We take derivative on both sides. We're gonna get a d u equals to four t to the third dt. Now four to the four times t to the third, you're gonna see that we do have it in front. Oh, that means I don't have to do anything. I can substitute du. Let's rewrite to see clear. So I have t to the fourth plus a four to the eight. Multiply four t to the third dt. So four to the d four t to the third dt. It is our du 
and in front that's going to be our u to the 8. Now we can use our formula to solve that. That's going to be u to the 9 over 9 plus a c. We substitute back our x. That's going to be, I mean our t, that's going to be t to the 4th plus a 4 to the 9th over 9 plus a c. So now let's look at our shortcut. So our shortcut, we define our u as t to the fourth plus a four. u prime gonna be four t to the third. We do have t to the third in front. That means I don't have to do anything. I can solve the problem right away. That's I'm just gonna copy the problem first. Take a look right here. We have u prime. We have u to the nth power dt now this is going to be equals to I'll be t to the fourth plus a four to the eight plus one which is nine over nine plus c now let's look at number three and four you have seen that U substitution shortcut can solve the problem very fast. So let's just try the U substitution shortcut first to see if the problem can be solved by that method. So let's look at number three. We have square root of 2x minus 1 dx. In order to change this to be exponential function form, we need to rewrite this into 2x minus 1 to the half dx. By u substitution shortcut, we define our u to be the base 2x minus 1. We try to find u prime, which is 2. We don't have it. Let's make it half times a 2. We put 2 in front of our function. So now this is done. It's going to be a half times 2x minus 1 half plus 1 over half plus 1 plus a c. That's number 3. Let's look at number 4. So we're going to define our u equals to 2t squared plus a 2. Our u prime derivative of 2t squared is 4t and derivative of 2 is 0. So we need a 4t in front. We do have a t in front. We are missing the 4. So we make a 4 which is 1 fourth 4 t. Now we have our u prime in front. Now we are u is 2t squared plus 2 negative half dt. So this is our u to the negative half. Since we have u prime in front, we're done. We're going to do 1 fourth times 2t squared plus 2. The power is negative half plus 1, which is a half. Uh, I'm just going to leave that plus a c. That's going to be our final answer. Thank you for watching.